Get it down. Get it down. Here. Get this. What's this? She get it down. What is up, Bitcoin land? Not a whole lot to talk about. And uh, it's just basically, I'm going to say the same thing I said in my last video and kind of the thing, same thing I said in the video before that. Bitcoin's really boring, but uh, this is what's going to happen, right? As, as soon as Bitcoin gets boring and people start stop paying attention. And then, uh, you know, they go to bed and they go to work and they go to bed and they go to work. And a little while later, they look at the price of Bitcoin as sitting at $85,000. That's basically what's going to happen eventually here. I don't know when for sure. If I did, I'd be a gazillionaire. But it should be coming here in the near future. For those of you that didn't watch my last video and haven't watched my previous videos, I've actually got five bullish, <clears throat> excuse me, five bullish structures here. We've got a bull flag. We've got a bull pennant. We've got a uh, descending parallel channel. We've got a descending wedge. We've got a descending triangle. I'm not going to go through that again. You can see that jumble of stuff there all pointing down. In my experience, folks, this is going to eventually at some point go simmer. Okay, so let's go down to the five-minute chart. Don't got a lot to talk about. My last video, I talked about the $60,800 level. I'm on Femex using USDT Bitcoin pairing, so the numbers will be a little different. But on different exchanges and uh, different pairings. But for my last video, the one development I have here is, uh, okay, that's enough, babe. You did good. You did good. I know. I see you. Stay out there. You a dog. You a dog. And that's a yard. Therefore, that yard is, belongs to you. You a dog. You a dog. Yeah, I know. This white horizontal line, I do apologize. Okay, that's enough. That's good. She did good. You did good. Good dog. Good dog. Two times it's tried to pump away. My last video, I left off talking about this white horizontal line, 60,800, is what I'm just basically all I have to watch right now because Bitcoin is going basically sideways. And uh, who knows for sure? It's just a coin flip if it goes up or down from here. It's tried to pump up twice away from there, and both times it's basically come back down. Now, this last time, it's only come down about halfway. As I make this video, it's sitting at 61,252, but it's still this, basically in the same place. Um, there's really not a whole lot of analysis here to make. <laughs> and this is kind of what I was saying at the very beginning. When it gets real boring and people stop paying attention and it just goes blah 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 that's basically after that little spill that's basically when this will pump hard it just seems to be how this works you know people get bearish and social media dies down and all the the simmer and the, the pepper and the sauce kind of seems to leave and uh no one really cares that's basically when when this will probably pump now, there could be a big dump before that, so I don't want to get ahead of myself and, and try to tell you it's going to pump from here. But all I really have to talk about is this red ascending channel on a five-minute chart. All right, this is only a, uh, let's see, 60,900 to 62,000. It's an $1,100 target channel. So it's not, it's not tiny, but it's not, you know, it's really not anything worth making a video about. <laughs> but what I do have to say is my last video, I was talking about the white horizontal line for the 10th time in this video, 60,800. Whether it's going to eventually break down away from here or like it's doing, trying to do now since my last video, come up here and, and get out of here and then and then go up who knows it's a coin flip in my opinion i do still expect a dump just like my last video exactly what i said in my last video i still expect a dump down 
And probably retest 56,000, if not 53. And that might not be a popular analysis, but I'm preparing for that. And you'd, you'd be probably, I mean, you need, you need to prepare for something like that. I mean, you have to keep that in your, in your game plan. I mean, because that could easily happen. I don't think it's going to go below 50. And uh, now it could. So I don't want to get ahead of myself. But my last video, I was talking about Bitcoin just basically going straight sideways, right? And so now that is actually turned into a little channel. And if you watch my videos, you know you like my I like my channels. And uh, so we've got the support, 60,800. We've got these two heart lines, these dotted lines going down, descending, are the macro, the two macro parallel channels I have drawn in there. And they're both real active, as you can see. You can just support on it, you know, support, 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 support. And uh, so watch those two lines, 60,100. 60,500 and 60,800. This is probably, you know, I mean, I, I, I like to give my opinion, but I don't like to give my opinion. My opinion, if you want to know my opinion, and it's just my opinion, is that this is still, you know, last 48 hours, I'm sticking to the same analysis. This is probably breaking down. It's probably breaking down. And this red ascending channel. And you can see I've got another one marked in there as well. Um, that's, that's probably coming down. But, you know, maybe I'm wrong. I could be totally wrong. You know, it's, it's just going to be a little move one way or the other. Well, I, I could be big eventually. But in the short term, it's, it's still basically going sideways. And uh, I'm trying to find something to say, folks. And I don't have anything else to say. <laughs> um, if it broke down... You know, a thousand dollars from sixty one hundred. That'd only be six thousand, and it would be basically this heart line here, and maybe it just bounces right back up and just keeps going right back up here, just the way it has been. So my analysis for today is it's going to go up, sideways, or down, and I sure hope you enjoyed it. Later. You know my real analysis: Bitcoin is in a downtrend in the short term while it's in a macro uptrend and that short downtrend should be reversing in the near one month or so, two months or tomorrow. Have a good day.